and welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome like I said or if you are coming back welcome back <laughs> so this is Sabrina from Sabrina's Books and Crafts and today you probably wonder what the heck is this what she has there um, today I do want to show you how I store my drills and I know this is really not um, the coolest way but I think for me it does work because I have it on in one hand what picture and what drills I need if some drill would pop out or would get lost so I will just start <laughs> how I do that um, this I will show you later and also this <laughs> so honestly my my things are very 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 easy um just just a minute forgot half of things I need. Alright, so, um, like I said, I do store my drills. I do that, I have just a box. This is just a cardboard box that I bought at, I don't know, Aldi, some discounter or somewhere you want. I, I think Ikea does have taller ones, so they might be better. But I just have this one. Alright, um... Okay, <laughs> I just start with the New York, because this is it. Um, in the box I have my leftover drills from the New York skyline that I made from Denmark Clock. Then this is German, like the birch forest. Then... <laughs> Something that I put in there that doesn't even belong there. <laughs> then the oops. Then this is the rose that um, came from the Romola store that I wouldn't really recommend. Then this is um, the car, the BMW, and the, then the aliens. So, um, long story short, I have an envelope that is the size of it's the German size the it's just an A4 like a huge it's like the a college um how are they called the things you write on <laughs> the college paper these it's like just a big envelope it doesn't have to have the window it's just I didn't have any any else. <laughs> so and usually I just do I put my those are leftovers from the birch tree. I just put them inside the envelope and I put my little envelopes that I always have. I I get rid of this paper clip. I usually fold this over again. And then I just put um, tape on it so that it it is safe and closed. And I put all of that inside of the envelope. The means. Um, so it's just it's just like that. It's just an envelope. I always write the name on it. Fold this over. I mean, it doesn't really that beautiful, but it. It works for me. I just put in, close it up. I had not that many left over here uh, on the New York skyline. So I was able to fold this over. It's like this is the whole envelope. And just fold this over. And I put it in those in one of those clear sheet covers. And put it in my in my little box. 
So because I know I'm probably weird <laughs> and um, but I like it when I know that there is one drill missing. I like to get the drills that came with that picture or that painting so yeah I kind of yeah I am like that so and that's just it I mean this is like my little storage <laughs> there are just one or maybe two left I'm looking for a better box because like you see it is not that big and what I told you um I have I have like more because there comes uh, with with every kid there comes a boat and a pan and tweezers and wax and well you know and I have don't call me crazy please I have a bag of baggies I just use the ever moment um bags because you have those zip thing here and you can close them so I put just all bags in here. <laughs> I know I'm weird. I because I know I have them and I know where they are. So then I have a bag of boats because sometimes I feel some boats are getting like a little gluey, you know, with the wax, you don't see that, but then I do kind of change. Just put them here. Then I have a bag of tweezers. I just for that I just used the one from from the Dan Art Club, but just because it was a good size. Then I have a bag of sponges, where I usually put them in when they come with a with an um with a kid. I just pull them off the pan. Put it in here. Then there are the bag of with pens. I know, I don't know why, but I do kind of collect them right like yeah, right now. Oh my god, <laughs> today is not my day. Then um so bag that I didn't put away. And okay, this is like the most crazy thing. <laughs> um I have a bag with pieces of wax in it and I usually put two pieces of wax in one little bag so little bags with wax in a bigger bag and I don't know but in my mind if it would melt but I think it would not get so hot in my apartment then um, they would all kind of glue together and I didn't didn't like that so that's just in the washi tape I just put back in. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you how I do store my drills. And I don't know if I would want to throw two colors together that came from two different kits. I know this is crazy because <laughs> I mean it's kind of the same but in my mind yeah, and you know, maybe someone knows what I mean. <laughs> so, and so I can just pull it out and go for it. So this is how I store it and I'm not willing to throw my spare drills out because you never know. I mean, you never know. So, Oh, and I forgot, I usually put in those this this um, inventory sheet, I always put it in an envelope. But you cannot see that, I think. <laughs> or at least I put it in those clear sheet covers. So, this is just a very... Yeah, it did take 10 minutes. Um, that was just my video on how I do store my drills and honestly if someone has a better idea Please let me know, but I don't want to put the drills together. So <laughs> But I think I need just a bigger box so um, You all have a beautiful uh, Rest of the day <laughs> a beautiful weekend beautiful week whenever you watch the video 
and don't forget to subscribe and help me grow my channel. Thank you guys and bye bye!